It is an unusual Cannes Film Festival. This year, the intermittent rains is a major detour from the Ready for Beach Carnival, often experienced here in Nice, home for Cannes. <laughs> The unique sound, beat and vibe from Nigerian music is a major draw, even if it's raining. The Lagos day started slowly, but gradually snowballed into one big party, overflowing the Lagos pavilion with lots of foods and drink. Guests and visitors couldn't hide their impression about the gathering and what Lagos mean to them. I like this, I like this, it's marvelous. It's one of the most uh, important uh, music now in Africa, the Nigerian music. Uh, so I must be uh, happy about this. Uh. Are you enjoying yourself? I'm loving it. There's music, there is food, loving it. Fantastic. It's fantastic. I like your culture and I like uh, how you are and dance and everything. It's, uh, it's different from Sweden. We are a little more stiff, you know, and we don't dance so much. <laughs> also met also other friends who want to uh, make shootings, uh, make co-productions with Af countries in Africa as well. So, and shootings there. Well. This, the party, yes. it's nice. You can dance, which is important. <laughs> Have you met any, anybody? Um, uh, a lot of nice people, made a lot of nice contacts. I'm looking forward to hear back from them, of course. But mostly today, I'm enjoying the dancing and the vibe. The attraction is more the flavor of Lagos that we have on display here. All of them have tasted it, they have enjoyed it, they've called more people to come. Then, of course, the sound, the beat of Lagos or Nigeria is another attraction. And it's been a win-win situation for us here today. According to the Commissioner for Tourism, Arts and Culture, Lagos State has significantly captured the attention of critical players in the global space. Many deals have been signed just because of the convivial atmosphere you know, that is happening. And I'm proud of what Governor Akimi Ambodi has approved for us, you know, for us to come here and showcase what Lagos is all about. It's about film, without a doubt. But it's also about art, it's about culture, and ultimately it's about tourism. All sorts that happen here, millions and millions of people come to this small resort city. This is our dream for Ekpe. This is our dream for Badagri. And that's why we say that we needed to be here to show what it means to be Lagos. This is a cool for show that you are seeing here, but it's serious business. It's the business and art of motion picture, of film, and of audiovisual. Make sure you spread the message that, you, that brought you here. Look, the main motive why we're here is to sell the idea of co-production to the rest of the world, meaning that people can come to Lagos and shoot film and also have a good time. And um, I can tell you categorically that a lot of the people who's been here already keyed to the uh, uh, to, to, to this agenda and I'm just looking forward to all of these things manifesting. Empty trays of food, empty glasses of wine, bottles of drink, music blaring at the background says it all about what has happened here tonight. It's been fun, fun and fun. Virtually everyone that gathered here tonight attest to the fact that there's no party like the Lagos party. But most importantly, it's about cementing relationship, it's about partnership, and making sure that those discussions that we've had in the past one week get to the final line. No doubt, Lagos is ready for business as far as the arts, entertainment, and culture sector is concerned. From the potato seed of the Lagos Pavilion, here at the 71st Cannes Film International Festival, I am Joshua Murakio, reporting for Lagos Television.